But Allah says, Kullu man alayha fan, O man, you will be ending, no doubt, who you are, your quality, your beauty, your nobleness, your righteousness, all and everything was belong to you in the worldly materialistic things, because if you're not there, this dunya is made to be end anyways. Because the first world was created and then we were placed. So then, so then if, if we, we are, are ending, ending what the purpose, purpose of this dunya? So, so that gives give us an understanding, understanding that as Imam Hassan al-Basari, a beautifully he shared the example. If we are traveling in a boat, uh, in an ark, ship, in the ocean, river, to have the joy, or, or to, to travel, travel to a distance, what it used to be in previous time, one of the main sources, and it's still one of the main sources of transportation, actually, uh, to transport the goods from one location to others, they use the huge ship. But while the person for entertainment, or just for the joy, or just for traveling on a big cruise from one destination to other, person has to get into a ship and ship has to remain on the water on the water what will happen if the ship is maintaining to remain on the water safely securely the goods a person individual they will be reaching to their destination while the ship is on the water but problem began if the water start getting inside the ship. Then is the moment of a painting. You see it? The long story and to the short. The what happened to the very famous ship? What do you call the Titanic when it hit to the ice or something? The water start coming in and that was Allah created the reason to be and the story, whatever the scenario is. So the same water which Allah created to be a moment of a joy, happiness, contentment, to get the need and necessity of one individual. But the same thing can become a destruction for one. Why? When a cross is born. Purpose of sharing that. This dunya, whatever is contained to it, the joy, happiness, each and everything Allah made it for us. But, but there is some, some boundaries, boundaries of do's, do's and don'ts. Don't. To, to the level, level that earn, work, work do a daytime day job, job, duty or, or the nighttime time shift. Earn in a halal way. But, but just remember, remember don't, don't go, go beyond, beyond and above, above to the level, level that forget what is halal, what is haram, what is the command and what is the recommendation. And just come to know that. Zaid ha bought the apartment, I have to get into the house. Umar ha bought the house, I have to get to the mansion. Khalid ha got to the mansion, I have to get to the villa. These names is usually used on the learning and teaching method. So if there is anyone names this, please forgive it. It's not to point out A and B, but these are very common names we use in our uh, uh, teaching, teaching method, method between, between the student and the teacher. At, At that, that moment, moment we, have we have to understand, to understand that, 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 that do I am? Seeing, seeing what is what halal, halal and haram, haram or do, do I'm, I'm just, just going, going desires, desires to the level, or this, or this dunya, dunya, which is a matter of a time, this life which is a matter of a time, this joy which is a matter of a time, that no matter what I have and own in my life, and because of this and that, I'm boasting here and there. Not ready to listen, not ready to behave, not ready to cooperate, not ready to act like a human being with due respect sometimes. This is not what I have because who I am. Any good I, you, we all have in any forms and means is from Allah. And if the believers, if they can carry out in their mind, we do respect. We do respect. We do respect. What, what happens? happens? We just we keep it eyes. eyes. Do the, the muhasaba. You know the muhasaba word, word is only nowadays. nowadays. It exists, exists, exists in the book, the book of suluk. What, what the muhasaba is? is? We do we respect. respect. We have we a have kind businessman. Business May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala bless him. Give uh, 
Baraka in his health and in his work. Every time he comes, he smiles. His, uh, his sons, every time he comes, he greet with a smiley face. That shows how good uh, tarbiyah the parent has given. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Ask the businessman when they're closing their business, a shop, what they do? They do the muhasaba of a day, the duration of a business. Today, how much? We gained it and how much was a loss. That's a system of a dunya. You check any businessman, any businessman, if they don't do the muhasaba at the end of a day, they go with the deadly mind in their house because they don't know what they have earned, they don't know what they have lost, and they have no vision and conclusion for which direction they will be coming tomorrow. And they will, and they will never, never be, be a great, great businessman business among their among circle, circle, among, among their, their society, society. Oh, oh, and the, wherever, wherever they are. They are. My, respected My respected brothers and sisters, we do respect. respect. Same thing. Our, our life, life, our, our days, days, our, our minute and moment, and very valuable than anything. Because if we fall lost and anyhow in anything, we get it back. But when the days are gone, yes. I, was, I really like, like a beautiful a word, a statement, statement when the khatib was saying last uh, Friday in the first Jummah, the people say time, time is money. Time is not a money. Time is something which cannot be, we cannot be paid through the money. Because anything you lose, you get it back. So I just want to add that those people who think time is money, their life is nothing but a funny this whole. They just want to eat and drink and enjoy and just wait for a time and then sudden the story will end and say bye-bye.